I have outlined five pitfalls you definitely want to avoid so you can manifest quickly, easily, without blockages. By avoiding these top five manifesting mistakes, you can harness the full potential of the law of attraction and create the life you truly desire. Hello, you powerful manifester. I am Sterling Meyer, manifestation life coach, and this is the AOM Art of Manifestation channel. Now, whether you are new to manifesting or you consider yourself a master, you are in the right place because you're either going to discover some critical mistakes that you never even thought of before that could be blocking your native natural ability to manifest anything that you want limitlessly, or you'll be reminded of what you needed to be reminded of to get back on track powerfully. Okay. So let's just dive into today's episode. No amount of believing in the law of attraction or manifestation will save us if we are unclear about common pitfalls that can hinder our journey towards achieving our goals and having a life we absolutely love. So I have outlined five pitfalls you definitely want to avoid so you can manifest quickly easily without blockages. Number one, negative thinking. Negativity can be a major roadblock to manifestation. Doubt, fear, and self-limiting beliefs can actually sabotage our efforts. So it's crucial to cultivate a positive mindset and practice gratitude daily. Think of it like this way. If someone has achieved something that you want to achieve or something similar, that's absolute proof that it's totally doable. And yes, you can do it too. How do I know this? Because you and that successful person are absolutely the same. Now you may be saying to yourself, oh my God, but they're richer, they're smarter, more privileged, more talented, or, you know, older, younger, fatter, or slimmer. You get the picture, nope, no excuses or arguments because there are countless examples of people who did not have these things and did it anyway. So consider yourself an equal because you are. We all possess the natural inborn ability to create anything we want and that's because we are creators and that's what we're here for. That's the purpose of our lives, to create something and experience it. When we create a thought, we experience it. When we sleep, we create dreams and we create physical things such as restoration and physiological aspects as well. So firstly, you have got to take full responsibility for creating your life, being the creator of your life so that you can start to create only that which you do want. Affirm and visualize what you want to be create an experience and drop that negativity once and for all. I discovered a book many years ago and it's called, You Cannot Afford the Luxury of a Negative Thought. And guess what? It's true. And this brings me to the next pitfall, lack of clarity. Okay. So one of the biggest mistakes that we make when trying to manifest our dreams is not being clear about what we truly want. Vague intentions, lead to vague results. So take that time to visualize and detail your goals. The more specific and vivid your vision, the easier it is for the universe to align with what you desire. If you are finding this video interesting, please do share it and hit the subscribe button. And um, yeah, share it with your friends, your family, social media. It really makes a huge difference for everyone. So I thank you for that. Now let's delve into the third manifestation trap. It's impatience and lack of trust. Manifesting, it's a process that requires patience and trust in the timing of the universe. Pushing for the outcomes or constantly doubting the process can create resistance. So trust that the universe has heard your intentions and is working behind the scenes to deliver your dreams at the perfect time. Next up, Failure to take action while manifesting involves aligning your energy into and with your goals. It's equally important to take inspired action towards your dreams. So sitting back and waiting for things to just happen without putting in the necessary effort 
can hinder your progress. So take proactive steps towards your goals and trust that the universe will support your efforts. Number five, attachment to outcomes. One of the most common mistakes in manifesting is becoming too attached to a specific outcome. Holding on to rigid expectations can limit the possibilities that the universe may present. So practice letting go of how and when your desires manifest and instead focus on the feelings and emotions associated with achieving your goals. You will be surprised how the universe knows exactly what you want more than you do. The journey of manifestation, it's a powerful and transformative process. Now, by avoiding these top five manifesting mistakes, lack of clarity, negative thinking, uh, impatience, lack of action and attachment to outcomes, you can harness the full potential of the law of attraction and create the life you truly desire. So remember the universe is always listening and granting you the life that you're creating. So be aware of your thoughts because we have 60,000 plus thoughts a day. So having a simple and easy way to manage, manage those thoughts are overwhelming, right? It will make all the difference, okay? So why not watch my video on how to be present in the moment to manage unruly thoughts? If you haven't already checked out meditating, ugh, is there a better way? You want to do that. Trust me on that. Yep, there is a better way. There sure is, and you're going to find out all about it right here on the AOM Art of Manifestation channel. And if you would like a step-by-step, -step, foolproof, total, step-by-step -step roadmap to manifesting your dreams easily and effortlessly and quickly, then contact us at getyourlifenow.com to gain access to the AOM system, Manifestation Mastery in 30 Days, a tried and tested manifesting secret system that's transformed the lives of thousands and thousands for over two decades. It's that good. Okay, so to manifest, you got to trust in the process, stay positive, take inspired action and allow the magic of manifestation to unfold in your life. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week.